I remember what these things do. Yeah. That was God, why are there so many rings, Barry? I can't remember all this shit. <laughs> five, five rings. <laughs> I can deal with like three tops. <laughs> yeah, I know. Let's just remove a couple. What is void? That's not an element. <laughs> That's the box at the bottom of the form. The uh, the god was creating the elements, and he was like, "Yeah, earth, fire, wind, air, uh, void." Okay, that too. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, I it. Yeah, it's it's everything that's kind of. Oh, I'll deal with that later. <laughs> hey everybody, welcome back to Ready Steady Play. You might notice it's a bit of a different setup today. In fact, the last time we had this set up was uh, when you and I were playing Destiny. Yeah, Star Wars Destiny, the, the dice collectible card game. Still playing? Uh, no. Uh, if anybody would like to buy a Destiny collection, <laughs> <laughs> please let me know in the comments. <laughs> but uh, we've got a brand new card game here today to replace it. Um, and uh, you've come back to play with me, Barry. Yeah, yeah. Well, the, the cult of the new. Anything new and shiny I'll get involved in. And then I'll regret it later on. But uh, for the time being, we're, we're good to go. You're selling your destiny to buy Legends of the Five Rings? Pretty much, yes. Yeah. Um, that and Arkham Horror, which you know, continues to eat up. Yes, I haven't had a chance to play as much of that as I, I would I only like. finished the uh, the first campaign, the Dunwich campaign, uh, last weekend, I think. So the, the decks have been out for a while, but I just hadn't done the last two uh, story modes or adventure packs whatever they're called asylum packs no, it's still going them. strong yeah so uh, very good interesting one and then the new big box is out so a whole new Carcosa right yes. yeah. I've kept my eye on it and I've gone I want to play that but I rather optimistically said that we'd do like a whole campaign on the yeah, channel yeah that's great in theory that, 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 yeah that worked out <laughs> yeah so look for those in the deleted scenes <laughs> <laughs> yeah content pending <laughs> So, uh, but today we're here to play through um, a game of Legends of the Five Rings. We've got our hands on a core set. Don't, don't, don't ask where we got it, though. <laughs> <laughs> and um, we've just set up the two introductory starter decks. If you checked out the rules and setup video yesterday, you'll know that um, how to play and what's going on. So I won't uh, bore you with all the details. All right. But, you bore uh, me with the details because I'm only half. <laughs> <laughs> it's fine. I know roughly how to play. Yep. You've got the crane deck and I've got the lion deck. Yes. Uh, from the start, so I'm all about, I guess, and with a little bit more development, a few extra cards, a few extra core sets, I'm all about the honour and the control, mm -hmm. um, and you're kind of just quite straightforward-ish, I think, you're all about the military and the, the conquest. I believe that's how it works in theory. Yes. Um, but with only one of every sort of character, and unique character and stuff, it'll be a little, uh, a little different experience from the core than a full tournament game. Mm -hmm. But uh, we're just going to sort of hang yeah. out, we're going to play through it, we're going to have some fun, and this will give you guys an example of how it sort of plays, and what you should expect from it. I, my understanding, we haven't rigged this or set it up in any way, <laughs> my understanding is it could last anywhere from about 10 minutes to 40 minutes. Yeah, provided, if, if, uh, assuming we know what's going on. Yeah. yeah, provided we don't spend too long staring at our hands going, what does this mean? And I must have accounted for this somewhere. Yeah, yeah. So the very first thing to do is decide who the first player is. That's the first thing that happens over everything. So I'm going to flip this. Politics. Politics. I did it, it. So one first player token coming your way. I get one fate to make up for such a heinous disadvantage. <laughs> and then we move over to our... Uh, what are these called? Provinces. These are provinces. These are our provinces. Says it on the card. Again, reading. Very important. <laughs> Lots of reading in these uh, LCGs, as you may well know. Most of the game is written on the cards. Right, let's put... Right there. And then, I don't really suppose it matters what order these are in, so I'm going to shuffle them up. This sits at the bottom here. To be revealed later during some sort of conflict. Exactly. This will surprise you, so possibly. <laughs> um, unlikely. <laughs> yeah. I think we've seen pretty much uh, what's going on here. Yep. Then the next thing, we're going to take cards from our dynasty deck and set them on our provinces. Exactly. Yep. And we get a chance to mulligan, so we can look at these. Uh, so I'm just going to pick them up in the right yep. order and uh, have a look. Have a look. That. Um, so I was thinking, like, um, I was uh, going through the rules and setup, and um, there was a, uh, I had a champion on one of these provinces in the opening of the game, and I was thinking, like, uh, do you think mulligan it's too? a good idea to have your champion out in, at the start? Um... It's not I think, a terrible idea. I think it's very risky. If your opponent can get off, like, can, like, if they've got a strong start and they just break a province, you could lose your champion, like, really early. 
Yeah. You can't if you don't bring them out immediately. Yeah, yeah. If you have them sitting, that's dangerous. Yeah. Yeah. Um, and certainly in the core set, because there's only one. Yeah, exactly. So you're never going to see that character again. Of course, if you were building a competitive deck, you could have up to three. Yes. Uh, have you mulliganed? Yep, I actually just kept it. Okay, that's fine. So Lucky I, draw. I didn't get to look at the cards that I replaced, uh, and then we get four cards from the conflict deck. Mm -hmm. Look at all this terminology. I'm an LCG pro. And same thing again, you can uh, mulligan. Hmm. Interesting. Uh, I'm going to mulligan one. Spicy. And then have a huh. shuffle. Where were all these cards when we played before? These are yeah. great. <laughs> So that is that. I'm going to keep these. <laughs> All right, fantastic. Then we take uh, what's on our cards. So I get 11 on her, you get 12. It's almost like somebody handily set that up for you over there. Although we uh, we um, actually don't pick up our fate until the dynasty phase, isn't that right? Um, yeah, we yeah but we're going to go into the dynasty phase anyway. So. <laughs> I'm just in mine now. <laughs> yeah, so another seven, which should put me on eight. So I got the extra one for you being first player. And you should have seven. Again, somebody lovingly counted that out. Oh, look at that. Well, did, I give you, did I give you too many, um, did I give you too much honour? Too um, much respect? Yeah, you gave me 14 honour. No, that's too much. I'll take it. <laughs> My counting skills in question. So, uh, moving into the first turn. Mm -hmm. Flip everybody over. Yeah. Flip, flip, flip the Delphi up. I'll so this is, uh, after the flip of these characters is actually the income step where we would gain our fate. But yep. uh, we won't take any more. Let's not be greedy. It's too early mm -hmm. for that. And spicy, all oh, spicy. Yes, I see we both have a set of reasonably priced characters. It's a good yep. start. Uh, well, speaking of starting, first action with you. Oh, jeez, that's right. It's me. Now, I would point out to our viewers at home that uh, these things here in the middle, these are in fact the five rings that the legends speak of, if you were curious. <laughs> <laughs> now, yeah. yeah, I mean, I don't know much about the actual... No, it's uh, the, the ones that come in the corset here. Not actual rings. Oh, well, that's also <laughs> true. Um, yeah, I never uh, thought about that. <laughs> I'm going to go ahead and just bring my I come a prodigy into play here. I'm just going to pick one. Okay, and the action him, after one or more fate is placed on them, you gain an honor. So do you want to... After one or more fate is placed on this character. Oh, sugar. All right, let's go ahead and... Uh, I'll invest... A, ooh, two, two, two seems a big deal. Let's put one on there. So you get one, you get an honor. Nice. Fantastic. I will... And immediately replace that person. Yep. Uh, sure, let's go... Mm. It's all very exciting. Uh, so I'm going to play the Doji Whisperer for one. And then I'm going to place one fate on her. Such a budget political powerhouse. A little bit, yeah. Like So 0-3 can't get, well I can get involved in military but probably going to lose those. But uh, <laughs> 3 on the politicking side. Slightly better than your game. I'd like to see a military conflict between these yeah, two. It's just, <laughs> just like slap fights. <laughs> military strength of zero. Whereas this one's above it all. She can't even get involved. She's like, Not nope. for me. So I think I will... Uh, I'm going to go ahead and pay... Three, four... I'll probably pay five, the remainder of my money, woof. in fact, woof, to bring out this Lion Pride's Brawler. With two on him? Two fate on her, yeah. And the action on him, well, this character's attacking. Choose a character with equal or military skills. That's all my guys, pretty much. And bow and them. And bow that character. That is, uh, yeah, I don't like that very much at all. She's pretty strong, and uh, I don't have as many of her as I would like, so. Not to worry. It's right, I'm going to go out with. Kakita, so I've cost three. I'm going to invest two on that as well. Get a replacement. Now her action is that if we're engaged in a political conflict, she can and you have more political power than me. She can use her action to gain a fate for better. Uh, uh, take an honor from take me. an honor. Yeah, take an honor from me. Yep. Take this one is an outrage from, from that opponent. <laughs> I thought you just gained an honor. It's outrageous. I don't. I won't allow it. <laughs> Watch me. 
All right, with that in mind, we're on to the most exciting phase, I think. No. Nope. No, wait, it's me, isn't it? Uh -huh, your action. She played. I, well, I pass because I'm broke. Yep, get a so fate. So let's take a fate. And then I will also pass. Very good. It makes it kind of seem like uh, the starting player token is sort of irrelevant. Um, yes and no. I mean, obviously, I could have three fate on, on here, whereas you wouldn't have that option. That's true. Right, so there, there are... Um, it doesn't seem too unbalanced. Yes, you get that back at the end of the turn, but yeah, it should weigh out. I'm just thinking I as the starting that. player, I'm more likely to pass first. Of course, being the second player does give you the option, the ability to react more effectively. Correct, yeah. So, uh, Yeah, many games going first is uh, not beneficial. So, draw phase. We're now going to bid some of our honour to draw some conflict cards. Unlike, uh, as we discovered in our recent yeah. uh, Champions of Midgard playthrough and worker placement games, going first is almost everything. <laughs> right, I have selected. Hmm. Now it's hmm. a shame if all that honor was to come over this way. <laughs> Neither way, Barry. I'm not very honorable. No. Nope. Uh, chosen? Yep, indeed. I went four. I went three. Well, one for you. Goody. Draw up the cards. <laughs> three, four, three for you. Yes, indeed. All right, we've got some fun stuff going on here. But you're not allowed to know. It'll be a surprise. So that you can't second guess how bad I'm playing. <laughs> Uh. Ooh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. So it's me to go first, isn't it? it certainly is. Ooh, mm, indeed. All right, well. So in terms of the sequence of play for uh, attacking, you're going to choose which element to attack with, which type of attack, where you're going, and your attackers, then I'll flip over the, the province. It's not before a Sipra. Britvic 7 up 3. Other brands are available. <laughs> I think I'm just going to go straight up. Military attack. How would? I know. I'm going to hit up this province here because if I can make you discard that guy, that yeah, would make me so right, happy. So the, the Wandering Ronin was very good during our previous game. <laughs> <laughs> um, huh? with which element type alright now let's think here this is very important don't mess it up mm. I do like the idea of honouring my lion's pride brawler I also like the idea of dishonouring your people <laughs> um, bring shame yeah so let's do fire fire with just the lion's pride brawler is that that's it. I'm keeping my other all one back right, here right. so that... Uh... So I reveal it before declaring defenders. Mm -hmm. Shameful display. During a conflict at this province, choose two participating characters. Honour one of those characters and dishonour the other. Well, at least the fire will help me return to normal. <laughs> <laughs> um, so I am going to defend with the whisper. Mm -hmm. uh, whisper. And um, I get first action. It's true, you do. Banzai. And I'm going to trigger it twice by losing an honor. What does that do? Uh, effectively, I'm four. So I get plus two. I can trigger it a second time by losing an honor. So I'm plus four military. Which kind of negates that little ability you've got going on there. I see your Banzai. Yep. And uh, I choose to action my uh, stronghold, putting my military up to four. That's fine. I'm going to action here. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to honour myself and dishonour you. I see. Well, Score's just... currently 3 to 5 for the attacker. Alright. Well, I'll tell you what I'm going to do then. I'm going to play Assassination and lose 3 honour. I'm going to cancel the effects of that action. Ooh. So when you uh, control more honoured characters than your opponent, so one to none, oh, yeah. uh, cancel those effects. You still have to pay the cost though, so you still lose three honour. Ouch. It just cancels the effects. Oh, sad times. Boom, smashing it. That, I, we had none of this back and forth last time. Yeah, but I feel <laughs> like that might be all my back and forth. <laughs> Ooh, do, um, hmm. Oh wait, I have a fate. Yeah, Ooh. spend it. Alright, here we go. I'm going to spend one fate to... Um, 
strength in numbers. Choose a character with loading X or lower. Move that character home. Ah, that's uh, X is equal to the number of attacking characters, one. Well, I don't think I can necessarily stop that. But at least you're not dead. Um, all right, I'm going to do some spicy. So that resolves, I go home. Indeed. Uh, I'm going to do some spicy actions. Okay. Might, might not be the best action, but I do that well. Do Noble that. Sacrifice. Sacrifice, a friendly, honoured character. Very well. Uh, discard. Choose a dishonoured character. Mm -hmm. Discard that character. Ouch. I think I come out ahead in that interaction. But I cannot be sure. If I have anything I can do about that. The answer is no. Jesus. Nice. That sucks. All right. So I lose an honor here as well. Uh, for being dishonored. Oh, yes. Yeah. And of course, my character dies, so I gain an honor. Uh, choose discard a character. No, sacrifice. Yeah, okay. So the sacrifice leaves play. That's fine. Yeah, you definitely came out ahead in that one. <laughs> yeah, boy. So it's currently zero to uh, zero as well, but um, nothing. So All nobody right. wins that. And Can't then, win if you don't have any strength. Very true. Now, nice. Oh, well. Let me come in with some shenanigans, shall we? Uh, what's my what's my jam? Let's have a little look here. I'm going to choose Void, because I think that'll be funny. And I will... Uh, politics. Here, because that looks quite good. Mm -hmm. With this lady here. Very well. So we've got the art of war. When this province is broken, draw three cards. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right. Well, I will defend with my Icoma Prodigy. I think that is spicy. Uh, you've got first action. Yeah. Oh, great. Um. I I pass. Uh, I'm going to make you go to sleep. Technically, you don't have to bow to do that, but it's just an easy way of remembering uh, that the action's been taken. Okay, well, I'm going to cancel that with the ready for battle. Uh, card effect, right, those card. Yep, that's fine. It I assume. Just means I don't bow. <laughs> yeah. It's called the, the not. It's an, It's essentially a fancy Legends of the Five Rings note card. All right, let's, let's keep going. I'm loving kind, this interaction. Kind of like your thing. A lot more fun now. Yeah. Uh, for Shane, during a conflict, if you control a participating courtier character, I do. Mm -hmm. Choose a participating character controlled by your opponent. This that guy. One. You must dishonor or bow it. Ah, well that sucks. Hmm. On the one hand, I don't really fancy being dishonored. On the other hand, I... I don't really... Well, I do I break care... it? Do I care about you breaking this province? You wouldn't break it? Yeah, you would. You've got three versus three. Uh, yeah, sorry. If you bow, I would break it. If you yeah. dishonor yourself, it'd be three versus one, which wouldn't be enough to break it. Either way, I'm okay. Um, and of course, you get three cards for me busting that. I've dishonored myself. Very well. Um, any actions? Nope. Me neither. <laughs> okay. <laughs> but I win, so I claim you do win. Uh, this trigger. That, yep. The void to remove a fate from it. Mm -hmm. uh, and then go home sleeping. Oh, I meant to trigger my action too. And what was your action? I would have stolen an honor from you. It's outrageous. You've already stolen enough <laughs> honor from me, Barry. <laughs> I'm going for the honor victory. <laughs> <laughs> got a long way to go. Yeah. With these corset decks. <laughs> Um, back to your challenge. Ah, yes, I'd like to make a political <laughs> challenge, but I seem to run out of dudes. <laughs> that is fine. Um, then we go to the no, imperial, imperial favor. Yeah, so the imperial end favor. of the uh, conflict phase, which you win because you have so a ring and I don't. don't. Yeah, mm. so I get that. I'm going to choose mm, spicy. Shall we make life? 
Yes, this makes life a little difficult for you. I'm going to put that on the military side. That does make life difficult for me, and I don't like it. Then, discard characters. So we're going into the fate phase now, yes? Uh, yes, let's go ahead and... So discard characters. Cheerio. Lose a number. Oh, yeah. Yep. Uh, you don't go, so you lose a fate. Then, add fate to the unclaimed round. Mm -hmm. Which is quite a lot this round. Uh, return this to a pool. And regroup, which readies everybody up. Everybody ready? <laughs> and that, yeah, that was easy for you. And officially, yep. done. So first player token will come to So me. we could uh, discard here, choose to discard any of our face-up cards <coughs> from our provinces. Uh, yeah, so this is the regroup phase. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So. so if we wanted to, we could get rid of these and replace them with face-down cards. But uh, I quite like my two here, so I'm going to hang on to them. Yeah, I also quite like mine, so I'm okay. And you've taken the starting player token. Yep. So it looks like we are back to the dynasty phase. Correct. So flip, flip, flip a Yeah, let's see who's hiding under here. Mm, spicy. Ah, and oh, wait, we should have got some money, right? Uh, that happens after flipping, I think. Okay. No, game fate, play characters. Oh, yeah, it doesn't matter. It doesn't Four. actually say flip. I assume it just... Uh, yeah. We At some point, do... that has to happen. <laughs> I mean, okay. we could play blind lottery... Am I more honourable than you? I've got nine. You, I'm You've a got ten. ten. Damn it. You're more honourable than wah, me. Wah. Yeah. Well, that's because you had... thwarted my assassination. Yeah, and I should have had one more as well. Or two more swing. Yes, let the uh, let that tiny misplay gnaw at you for the rest <laughs> of the game. <laughs> it's alright. Be in a minute. Yes, <laughs> I'm sure you will. <laughs> all right. uh, me first. I'm first player. Uh, I'm going to drop this fella for one. Um, yeah, man. I will. Hmm. Got a lot of spicy stuff here. So his text says that he cannot participate in clone. Uh, he basically he can't yeah. attack me if I'm that. But I'm but Barry's that. that. <laughs> <laughs> um, Barry is the empire's em emperor's favorite. No, because he could be situational. Like if you end up winning more next round and he can't attack, then you put in fate on him. Seems like too much. So I'm just going to replace that card. You're not cheating. Okay. I've got my Otomo Courtier here, who's the same sort of equivalent of your one. Um, but I do have the card. <laughs> mm hmm. <sighs> That's a mighty refreshing beverage. <laughs> do you have to declare sponsorships at the start of the video? I don't know. <laughs> yep. Um, I declare that we've got no, no sponsorship, sponsorship yeah. whatsoever. Shocking, I know. <laughs> but people are clamoring to pay for, me for, for this. For this kind of high quality production. <laughs> yeah, I just don't understand it. What's going on? Um, Professional players. So I think, let's uh, let's pay one. I'm bringing my Otomo Courtier. Can defend? Yeah, man, it's just going to hang out. Uh, no fate on it? No. Nah. All right, all right. I will. She's cool. She's chilling. She's like, look at this. Look at this thing I wrote. <laughs> Do you like my song? One doji gift giver. And I will put one fate on her. She's courtier. Wow, this. Uh, co is it courtier? Courtier. Courtier. Um, courtier. <laughs> <laughs> While this character is participating in a conflict, give your opponent one fate. That opponent must choose a ready participating character he or she controls. Bow that character. So effectively, you're going to have to mm. overcommit to the... Uh, oh, and then I replace the card. I don't like uh, I don't like this um, bowing nonsense. My people don't like to bow, Barry. I believe it. All right, so let's bring out the uh, Akoto Gunso here. I'll pay two for him, and I'll put a fade down on him as well. So pride, that's a key word I've not seen. Uh, when he wins a conflict, um, I can honor him, and mm. if he loses a conflict, he is dishonored. That sounds really He is replaced, too. faced up by Matsu Biona. <laughs> sounds good. Mm. Um, sure, I will also. Let's go big. So two for this guy, and I will place a fate. Just to have a little bit of a board next turn. Mm-hmm. All right. Well, I think I will do the uh, same here. 
I'm going to put down two there to bring up my venerable historian. I'm going to fail you. And the action on that horse card is participating in the conflict. If you're more honourable. Uh, 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 <laughs> uh, honour that character. And he's got three honours. That's not bad if you can get that going off. Or three, yeah. three glory. Yeah. Which translates to three for ten. Uh, I'm going to pass. Thanks for my money. Seems fair. I will uh, also pass because I'm out of things You get nothing. Too. I get nothing. That <laughs> sucks. All right, all right. Well, now I need to go back. Uh, we're done with that. So, honor phase. Uh, honor phase, draw phase. Basically. Yeah, draw phase. That's what it's called. Um, all right. I'm going to bid zero, even though it's explicitly <laughs> against the rules. I've chosen. Spicy. That's a fuck. Two. One. Mm. So, I give you one honor. So, that helps you out with it. It does. That. that was my whole thing. <laughs> One, two. Oh, good. Something I can't afford. All right. All right. Um, very well. Let me have a look at what these rings do. So conflict phase, any pre-conflict actions? I don't have any. Um, I, I don't have any at this time. Okay. Looky, looky. I might not have any ever. Hmm. The good news is that he has to break three provinces and then break my stronghold to win, which means he can't win this turn. <laughs> that is correct. He can only initiate two conflicts. Uh, well, actually, I'll tell you what, I, I do have a pre-challenges action. I will use him to turn a face-up card on one of my provinces face-up. Oh, yeah, okay. Mystic. No good. Right, what do all these do again? Um... Mm, spicy, spicy. Well, the Ring of Fire, if you initiate a military conflict with the Ring of Fire, then uh, the ring instead of, of fighting you all, uh, it makes more sense. Ring of Fire. <laughs> sure, let's choose a military challenge with this guy using the... Mm, great question. Mm-hmm. So many choices. I mean, I guess I have to go air. Just to uh, air. What on earth is that? Take your honor. No. So just him on his own. In a military conflict. In a military conflict, for which I have plus one. I oh, know it's. Let's just put those together so we can very deeply upset see the numbers. So four. So unlike oh. um. The guys that play thrones and cry about having to do math for the other player. Uh, it's very explicitly stated in the rules that you must tell the other player your values when you're attacking. Oh, yeah? Oh, yeah. Thrones people are like, I'm not doing math for you. Those guys aren't fun. Um, <laughs> I'm very unsportsmanlike. Like, well, the, the Barry, what's your political power here? Yeah, exactly. The, but the problem is, like, if you if you miscount and you've told the opponent something wrong, um, then that can come back to you kind of thing. Yeah. But it's on, it's on yeah. both players to remember. But if you've done the math anyway, you can at least say, oh, I believe I'm on four. So three plus one, you can go through it together. Um, I've played a few game of Th uh, Thrones games where we're going to resolve the uh, the challenge and it's been like, oh, uh, actually, oh, I'm on 15, not 14. I've I've won. Yeah. 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 But know? that that can kind of happen. You don't have to yeah. tell players, of course, what you what tricks and stuff you've got. Oh, I'm on uh, four after I play this. No, um, <laughs> you can but, obviously uh, I mean, we, we, we play so many cards and there's so much stuff going on by the end of it, we're not even sure ourselves what's yeah. going on. <laughs> All right. So just to be clear, you're on one and four. <laughs> I'm on one plus three, four. Attacking this to give you some cards. Does that sound not good to you? Oh, that's great. I won't defend. You can. I just want the cards. <clears throat> give me those cards. Spicy. Stand by. <laughs> no, no. Right, actually, no defenders. Been... Yeah, undefended. That's not bad. I also have no reaction to winning. So no actions, no reaction to winning. Um, unless you've got reactions for winning. Um, oh, you mean reactions for losing? Uh, well, yeah, that's true. My bad, dog, my bad. <laughs> I got, uh, my reaction to losing is sad face. That is acceptable. Um, so I come home and sleep. I take this. I steal, I'm going to steal one honor from you because that seems like a better share. Mm -hmm. And I'll just keep a hold of that for later. All right, so my province is broken, so I must discard my spirit collar. Yeah, get which out makes of me here. deeply upset. I'll replace that with a face down card and draw three of these. Mm. 
Aha. Where was this when I needed it? <laughs> Alright, so, what have I got going on here? What's the action on shameful display? You can dishonor uh, and yeah. honor a character. That sucks. Yeah, you don't. You probably don't want to go there. But. Yeah, I, pro I don't want to go there. I know I don't want to go there. <laughs> Alright, so, um... Minions can't eat red cards. Let me just see if I can get us a little extra space here. Oh dear. You just got three cards. You must have a handful. Yeah, but the problem is Barry has no fate. <laughs> but you can get fate when you declare one of these three challenges. Yes, indeed I can. Um, indeed I can. Mm hmm. <laughs> hmm. Hmm. Is that uh, plus one to all your characters? Plus one on military challenges total. To all total, total. not to all characters. Just okay. plus one. I knew that. See, I did it once instead of video. <laughs> so your uh, yeah, your ability is uh, plus one to all your characters. Yeah, but unfortunately, I can't give plus one to characters that have dashes. No. Let's go for a military challenge then. Uh -huh. um, and let's go for a military challenge. I think I'm just going to pick one of these at random and hope that it's. <laughs> that's tactical oh well these are random yeah, I yeah. You pick one of these are oh no God, no. <laughs> no no I'm, I'm pretty confident I'm going to go for earth here mm. um, it's just that uh, the problem is I know that one of your provinces will flip this from a military into a political yep <laughs> unless it's up there under the stronghold you never know I never know but I don't really want to go for the shameful display because uh, that will immediately reduce my military to zero shall I shall I let you into a small secret if you remember, that was actually the card that we were missing from the core set, waiting on the replacement. So, and I replaced that card with an official one. Oh, did you? Did. So you actually took that out. So I don't have that card. Oh, interesting. So you've just advised me that the thing I thought I knew is not actually a exactly. thing that is the thing. <laughs> okay, interesting. So yeah, I'm one card different from the starter decks. So. Well, I guess I'm forced to drink the wine in front of me then. <laughs> uh, I'll just go up here. Uh, very well. So you're attacking. Uh, after this province is revealed, switch the contested ring with an unclaimed ring. Oh, interesting. The conflict retains its type. So, I can swap it with any one of these. Do I get the the void thing? The fate? Yeah, the fate. Swap the ring with it. I feel as though the fate would pass back onto the earth. Um, For the purposes of moving things along, let's go with that. Uh, so, like, uh, when you pull the tablecloth out from under something, the everything just falls yeah. down. Um, so... It is now... I'm sure that's not actually what happens, but... What? Water? Water. I'm glad I used this guy for a useless sword. Yeah. <laughs> uh, very well. And I shall defend with these two. Hmm. Okay. That puts you on a grand total of four. Two, three, four. Yes. Okay. Well, that's problematic for me, Barry, because that means that you Oh, are... you never... Uh, did you defend that one? I did not, so I must give up on honor. Yep. Obviously, relevant with that character especially. Yep. Yeah, she is pretty garbage <laughs> at the moment. <laughs> um, okay, so what I'm going to do here is uh, I'm going to uh, do nothing because it's your uh, action. Uh, yeah, so I've got first action. Um, and my action shall be to play this there. The above question, what does that do? Attached character cannot be chosen as the target of an opponent's event. That's fine because I don't have any events that I want to target her with. All right. Uh, Man, I've got to... Okay, so I'm. what I'm going to do is I'm going to action my stronghold to go up to three. Spicy, spicy, I like it. I'm approaching a level at which uh, I can compete with you. Uh, Are you worried yet, Barry? Are you worried? Not just yet. Carry on. I'm going to pass my action there because I'm still winning okay. at the moment. Yeah, so what? All right, all right, all right, all right. Okay. I will uh, throw down this way of the lion to 
to double my base military to four. So it's four, five, you're on five, there. Five, yeah. I'm going to give myself one of these here katanas. What is that? Fire katana. Fine uh, katana. Plus two, so two, three, four, five, six. What am I on? Five? Uh huh. This is outrageous, Barry. <laughs> this is absolutely outrageous. All about the shenanigans. Who doesn't love a good shenanigan? Who doesn't love a good shenanigan? Ooh, I have some interesting stuff going on here, Barry. I'm excited to see it. Don't know what it is. <laughs> Don't know what of the. Mm, I've got options. You already made a political challenge? I have, no, I made a military challenge. You made a military I have challenge. Politics to go, which is. Which is your person there. Yeah. Okay. Well, or set in defense. One of the two. So I'm on five, you're on six. Yes. Mm -mm -mm. Entertaining it's viewing here. Isn't me going, hmm. Oh, I've got two options, you see, Barry, and I'm trying to decide which one I like better. I think I like this one better. I'm going to pay one to equip an honored blade of my own. Well, that is spicy, isn't it? So I go up to seven. That is not bad. Not bad at all. Uh, very well. I should play this. During a conflict, choose an opponent's character with a lower political skill than a participating courtier. Move the chosen character home. All right. So I go home. Yep. But you're still standing. I'm still standing. All right. Well, I guess uh, I have nothing further to do. Uh, so I will have that over there, shall I? Thanks very much. Come home, sleep in. Come home, sleep in. Okay. Now, I can't really stop you on the political scene, I don't think. Um, but it can make things a little trickier for you. So, um, I'm going to choose mountains, politics, there, with this one. Yeah, right. So I will reveal. Do -do -do -do. It is pilgrimage. This is the one where the, the you don't get the ring thing unless you break it. Yeah. How much is it to break it? Five. Oh, that's rude. During this during conflicts of this province, cancel all ring effects. If it breaks, though, resolve the ring effect as normal. All right. So you've brought a two. I've officially brought it. Yeah, but you can take an action whereby you give me one fate and then bow your character. I mean, then force me to bow yeah, a character. You have to go sleepy sleeps. I don't like being sleepy sleeps. Um, trying to decide, and I can't. Um, well, on the plus side, currently I can't break it. Are you suggesting that I just lose further honor and allow it to go undefended? <laughs> no. <laughs> but you can chump block. <clears throat> or do you think that the four you've got down there is enough to um, I feel like I feel like I'm going to uh, block with these two both of them indeed the venerable historian and the autumnal courtier mm. indeed feel the power of my political influence I'm Barry. feeling it I'm going to give you a dollar you can choose one of them. So you actually have to give me one oh, face. Oh, uh, carry on. Actually, you've got first action. Oh, I've got first action. I, I have no action. I'm going to give you a dollar. And now I have to kneel one of these characters. Yep. Can you guess which one I'm going to kneel? This one. It is, in fact, <laughs> the venerable historian here. Yeah. On account of the fact that because I have less honor than you, she's Doesn't do anything. serving no purpose at all. Um, very well. Uh, so it's two to two at the moment. Um, your actions again. Oh, indeed. Remember, of course, Tacker wins twice. It is true. So currently, you are set to win this one. Now, that's annoying. <laughs> <laughs> I, uh... <laughs> I have no, no action. Uh, I, too, will pass. So, uh, I 
win, but I don't get to trigger the effect. But I do get to eat. Yeah. Indeed. I don't think I'm going to be able Come to do sleeping. much to compete with you on this ring front here. Um, depending on what happens next. Um, and then over to your challenges. Yeah, so I've got a political challenge. I can't make it with the Atoma Courtier because you have oh, the Imperial she's Favor. Uh, she is knelt, in fact. Yep. That's true. Bowed. 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 Wow, wow. Probably the first time that joke's ever been uh, made in reference to L5R. That is Legend of the Five Rings. Hmm. Why don't play some Magic the Gathering? <laughs> I don't, know how, I don't know how else you play, but you just do this all the time. This is right? a thing they do in Magic. <laughs> <laughs> um, I think I would like a Fate and a Ring. Fire seems good. Fire. So I think I will enter into a political uh, challenge with my Akoda Gunso. A new one? Uh, An existing one. Well, it would be great if uh, I could if you still had that thing that flipped it to a military. Yeah. <laughs> But uh, I would like to go for the Void. I'm so tempted to go for the Void and remove that fate. That would be spicy. That would be spicy. On the other hand, though, if I go for the Fire, I could yeah, dishonor yeah. that character, which wouldn't be sad for you as well. Wouldn't um, be great. <laughs> it would not be great. Um, so, yeah, let's go for Fire, because fate is good and fun to have. Um, yeah, let's gather some intel. All right, all right. So, uh, I'm coming in here. Let's see what we've got. Night Raid. After this province is revealed, your opponent chooses and discards X card from his or her hand equal to the number of attacking players. Attacking characters, sorry. So well, I... Choose a card to bring. Yeah, I got off lightly there. Uh, let's, uh... And this is a political challenge. Let's go ahead and bin uh, Spies at Court. When I win a political challenge... Ain't never gonna happen. Ain't never gonna happen. <laughs> uh, I can dishonor a character participating to discard two cards from your hand. It is spicy, but I feel like it's a situation that may not arise. And yep. also, I don't like the idea of dishonoring my peeps. No defenders. First action for me. Indeed. Go to sleep. <laughs> Bow me. God <laughs> yeah. damn it. Ugh, forgotten about that. Yep, there's nothing I can do about that. So nothing happens. Effectively gets returned. And that is the end of the, well, Imperial Favor. Stays with me. I can switch it, but I yep. think I'm happy with it staying on the military side. Mm -hmm. um, and so, because it's three to them. Indeed. Uh, cool beans. Fate phase discard characters. So this guy goes. Anybody uh, remaining loses a fate. Very well. And then add fate to the unclaimed rings. Just two. So these can return. Everybody mm -hmm. stands up. Everybody's ready to go one more time. And I am going to uh, regroup. So everybody stands up. You want to get rid of any of your cards? I think I'll keep mine. I think it's okay here. Yeah, I'm quite happy with my only face-up card here. All right, all right. Pass the first player token to you. And then we're back into the dynasty phase. Indeed. Here we go. Dynasty, round three. Oh, so spicy. Alright. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yes, I can count. I am gonna win. <laughs> Great success. <laughs> Great success. Hmm. Uh very well. I'm First starting action with you. Player, indeed. Alright. I think I'll throw down uh Fate here to bring in my uh, seven guardsmen. Nice. Although he cannot attack me. No, but he, he will. Defend. He will defend. <laughs> right. Let's get these guys out. Right. Hate this man. One, two, three, four. Ugh. Show me what you got. <laughs> All right. So I'm going to pay two to bring out my Death Seeker. That sounds like a good card. Don't know what it does, but... Uh, she's the one where if she loses the conflict, I can sacrifice her to remove a fate 
from the attacker. Indeed. Oh, she's got to be the attacker, sorry. Okay, okay. After the, after this challenger, who's going to get as an attacker? Yep. Mm -hmm. Then I'm going to pay three to bring out Matsu. Well, steady up. Oh, no, it's you. you put any fate on there? Nope. I'm going to pass. <laughs> All right, then. <laughs> I got overexcited, Barry. I know, I seen you were getting Played my hand. Away. I'm going to uh, bring out uh, Matsu Biona. <laughs> Bi yeah. Yep. You're and, so uh, smooth with these names. <laughs> so uh, I've got uh, three Bushi characters in play, so she gets two Fate on her coming into nice play. Nice for free. Exactly. But I think I might even drop another Fate on there Oof. as well. I'll just keep her around a bit. Sure. A bit of time, because at the end of this round, I'm going to be clearing this board. <laughs> Yep, and we're just going to sing here. All right. And then I pass. Uh, very well. So let's move to the uh, draw phase. Bid some honor. Do, 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 do. Yeah, man. I've chosen. Oh, me too. One. Two. Well, let me have a look here. I might have a card to play. Uh, oh, yeah, okay. Hmm. Nope. Nope. I don't, it turns out. I'm going to take this from you. That's fine. Whoa. I get one card, you get two. Indeed. Yes, now I have all the cards. Fear me. I shall not. Right. <laughs> 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 um, that is now your challenge. First challenge of the sesh. Yes. Well known uh, that samurai and Bushido warriors often enjoyed a good sesh. <laughs> A good sesh of uh, conflicting. All right, yeah. let's have a look here. We've got void. Conflict phase. <clears throat> and we've got fire. All right, well, I think I definitely want to have void. Oh, so right. Yeah, I know. Well, I just hate that wandering run in so much. <laughs> All right, so let's go military. Let's go. So shameful uh, display. That lets you choose. Honor, yeah. Or do I choose who no, to dishonor? I choose two participating characters, honor one. And dishonor the other. This is. That would be a shame, wouldn't it? Really shame. Really good shame. Shame, shame. No, you know. All right. Let's think about what's gonna gonna happen. Um. We've only bossed one province so far. What time are we on? Three. Yeah, we are. We're not doing well, Barry. No, we're not not doing. Oh, well, snowball. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> everything will go out of control. Wildly out of control. Um. Can any of you people's politics? Wow, what do you mean by you people's? My people's. <laughs> My people's are not good politicsing. Uh, what's that one? After it's revealed, that's yeah, yeah, right. Yeah, so that does nothing now. Oh, the, the wandering Ronin. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Let's go. Military attack here. I'm going <laughs> to hit that man. Yep. I'm going to uh, commit my Akoto Gunso. Yep. I'm going to send in my uh, Death Seeker. Yep. I'm going to send in my... Sipping Guardsman. Oof. And uh, let's. Uh, is that it? Or do I send in everyone? And then just watch as you send in no one and I have nothing left to defend <laughs> at all. Oh, and that's live. <laughs> that's live indeed. Yes, indeed, it is these three. Those three. Very well. Uh, I shall defend, I suppose. I shall defend with these two. The Wandering Ronin and the that guy. Correct. I get first action. Right, you want to revise your... Yeah, so I'm not cheating. <laughs> Okay, well, that changes things yeah, a little. Please uh, revise your position as well. Um, That's my fault. I forgot about him being the Emperor's favorite son and me being the reject, <laughs> the rejected stepchild. Oh. It does. I need more money. Yes, I'm rolling in the riches three times the money you have. Yep. <laughs> With three three glorious fate. Uh okay, first action, boost him. You'll go. He's now a four four. He's now a four four. Yeah, so it's four, five, six, seven. And he can eight. do that twice, right? Yeah. Alright. 
Which puts you on 11, right? Uh, no, uh, so 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Oh, yeah, yeah, okay. My bad. I thought we were totaling the Wandering Ronin's potential. I'm going to spend uh, 1 only takes me to, 10, but, yeah. to use Root, which allows me to send home one of your characters that has a lower military skill than one of my Bushi characters. Which is nobody currently. Well, uh, Kodogunso's 4. Hi. Oh, yeah, of course he is. Is the Honor Blade, so, so I'll send that one home. Um, yeah, he just goes home. He's not. He's he ran away. That is fine. Or we call it a tactical retreat, perhaps. Uh, so you're three, four, five, nine. So my four, five, six, seven. Six, seven. Okay. So I will activate my stronghold to give them all plus one. Uh huh. Hmm. Action. Choose a face down card. <laughs> action. Well, your action. Your um, You're currently running 10 plays 7. 10 to 7? Mm -hmm. That's not enough to break your province. No, but it's enough to break my spirits. Tell you what, I'll stick the uh, fine katana here on Matsu Bayona for another that plus is 2. Crazy, isn't it? Mm hmm. Oh, no, wait, you're, uh, you're more than that, because it's plus one per character, right? Yeah, yeah. So, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, you're on. Well. You can do it anyway, but yeah. Okay, I'll do it anyway. Yeah, so, okay, I'm going to sack this off. Mm -hmm. uh, if I draw a card. Or this one. Does it help? No. It's nice, though. I need more money. So, you're on 12, 14. My seven, is that right? Quite possibly, yes. Um, I stopped doing the math. I have decided to allow you to be in charge of the mathematics for this one. That's fine. So six, three, nine, five, fourteen. Thoughts? Um, I don't... Ah, I guess I just have to give that one up. Yep, so you smash me. So wait, it's my action. Yeah, yeah. All right, cool beans. Uh... I think actually this happens later, so... Um, well, reaction to winning, so I've uh, passed and passed. So I've got a reaction after you break a province. Uh-huh, which is next. Uh, for greater glory, it says, uh, during a military conflict, uh, after you break a province, uh -huh. during a military conflict, place one fate on each participating Bushi character you control. Yep. Um, it says, it also says max one per conflict. Does that, that um, means that the card. card. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, so I can't. And also again, with a single core set, not a huge problem, because you only get one. Quite possibly. So I have to pay one for that. Yeah. I think. And then, all and then I get, get uh, three. A spicy meatball. So you take this. I presume yeah. you're taking a. Yeah, one off the Wandering Ronin. Yeah. Now, if I'm not wrong, this also allows me to uh, discard that card. Yeah, yeah he goes. Um, it's replaced. Indeed. Yeah, get rid of. Don't, don't like them. Yeah, yeah. Now, what I do have is an opportunity here to sacrifice my Death Seeker to nope. remove a fate. Oh, yeah, because I didn't lose. You, you won the conflict. I know it's unusual for you to win. <laughs> I'm not used to this, this experience. They, they all bowed. Uh, they are all bowed. Yeah. Sad times. Oh, and uh, this man becomes honoured. Uh, why? Uh, well, he's got pride, which is if he wins a After conflict, this... oh, yeah, he's in, he, he, he gets honoured. But yeah, he's yeah. also got this one that says... Uh, oh, no, it says gain one honour. So I gain, one honor. Yeah, so I gain so... an honour and he becomes honoured. Yes. Wow. Um, but he's still sleeping. I, yeah, that's true. He's still sleeping. Uh, one honor. Good. I need that. I'm woefully behind on the honor front. <laughs> and where's this dishonor gotten me? Right, me? Yes, indeed. Action. Good omen. Play only if your honor bid is lower than your opponent's. It is indeed. Uh, choose a character print it costs three or higher. You. Yep. Place one fate on that character. Yep. Action. We have the crane. Choose a crane character you control. That, that one. one. Honor that character. Oh dear. Right. So that's pretty spicy. Right, what does fire do? Honor or dishonor? Seems reasonable. Okay, so I'm going to military. Mm -hmm. Here. Get my money with a crystal gift. So you're military on the pilgrimage with uh, Kakika Asumi, Asami. Correct. Oh dear. 
So that is two, four, five, six, can't be. Well, I will block with my Seppin Guardsman. Mm. Because my venerable historian seems to have lack <laughs> <Yeah>. military skill. <laughs> Any kind of uh... Any kind of tangible military skill. Yeah. What is the honor on him too? That is outrageous. Um very well. Uh defender's first action. Um in this instance I choose to do nothing. Okay, I will charge during a military conflict, which this is. Mm -hmm. Put your character into play. In the conflict. I see. So it's now seven to two. Well that's outrageous, Barry. That's an affront. I'm looking at these cards like they're useful. They're not. <laughs> no. Oh, interesting. This is interesting. Yes. I'm going to sacrifice the uh, favorable ground. I can add a character to the conflict or bring one home. I'm going to put my Death Seeker in. Okay. But remember, it's only if you lose as an attacking character. So. <sighs> is it? In card text. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, what's he doing that for? Can he stand up? And I was like, no, I think I know what you're doing. <laughs> I'm trying to be not tricksy. Not how it works, yeah. Yeah, not how it works. Well, that's why I am, you know, that's why I'm so glad you came to play this with me, Barry, because you understand. <laughs> the intricacies. Can you imagine if I filmed this with um, myself? <laughs> Playing both sides. Yeah, everyone would be yelling at me. That's not what that does. That's not how that works. You're doing it incorrectly. Um, that's why I like going through, like, just step by step. So, like, you know, choose a character, choose him, then do the thing. Mm-hmm. I mean, you have a good... Okay, there's nothing further I can do. I'm uh, trying to be clever, but there's nothing <laughs> clever for me to do. Very well. So I beat you by five. So two, three, four, five, six, seven to two, one by five, which breaks the province. Indeed it does. And that will allow me to dishonor mm -hmm. that there. Indeed. Uh, I will then come home mm -hmm. and go to sleep. And it is your goal. Okay. Still have these characters awake. No, actually, I have an action before. Yep, you have an action. Uh, I'm going to sacrifice this guy to get rid of that attachment. Makes sense. And that kind of makes him fairly useless now. Indeed it does. So you still have a... Mil well, there's nobody to military with unless you've got a character in no, hand. No, I've got a political... Uh, this is your uh, no you want a political channel oh, that's, well, not that's, your that's definitely See, very, very important to remember back <laughs> uh, that's money right you've got yeah that's my money yeah because I kept getting mixed yeah, up yeah, with yeah, my fake yeah. tokens um, I don't think I can make a political challenge here Barry I'm pretty sure that it would be both meaningless and a bit silly sure um I prefer the idea of perhaps getting paid to bow my venerable historian. <laughs> uh, yes, that might have to happen. Right, well, let's go with uh, politics. So what are my choices here? What does what? You've taken void, earth does, draw a card, then a card. Water is ready, somebody. Not super useful. And air is steal some of your honor. Hmm. <laughs> well, that is spicy. Mm -hmm. uh, however, I think I'm going to politics here with both of these guys. Yeah, it makes sense. And I will defend with my venerable historian. Um, okay. Are you happy with that defending? Yep. Yeah. Uh, well, you, I, yeah, I well mean, you can flip it before you change. Actually, right? well, so I've declared, actually, no. I've declared the attack. Okay, yeah, let's have a yeah. look and see what's going on. Because I was going to, like, you don't know what's going to happen. Uh, during a conflict with this province, gain one fate. Well, that's cool. And then you can declare defenders. Yeah, I feel like you've still got your stronghold ability, so I, is there any point in you even going in there? Depends what shenanigans you've got, of course. <laughs> what shenanigans I've got? Yes, my many shenanigans. Um, well, at least if I'm bowed, I still don't lose the honor, right? Correct, you won't, uh, it will still be opposed. Of course, if I'm standing, I actually, glory three. Correct. So that's what I was waiting for you to notice. Yeah. So that'll be three to two. 
If I don't defend, can, do I still have an action window? Uh, yes. As the defender? Yep. Okay. Um, to, if I don't defend, you can just go straight for my front ones. And I've only smashed one of yours. Okay, here's the plan. No defense. Yep. My first action, I'm taking a fate. Yep. Um, could use... I unfortunately cannot boost myself by one. <laughs> uh, which is a little annoying. Sweet serendipity. Yeah. So, end of that. So, I uh, presume there's no other actions. I'll win the conflict. Um, can I use that one again, please? No. <laughs> uh, which means I'll discard a card from your hand and draw a card. So, let's just do it in the right order. It's uh, uh, random? Attacking player draws one card mm. and discards one card. Uh... Not this one. That would be a shame. Mmm, that looks good. It's okay. Not bad. What does this do? What text in it? Alright. Oh, sorry, <laughs> shit. I got. I, I was like, oh, what does it do? I'm excited. I totally forgot. I'm not supposed to be looking at those. It's fine. What I did see means nothing to me. Mmm, <laughs> spicy. Uh, very well. Come back sleeping. Mm-hmm. How would you like one of these bad boys? I'd love it. Thank you, Barry. <laughs> I would like one political, please. Yep. Do a little work for you. Then um, let's just do the tidy up, shall we? So discard characters. So I'm losing Boop. both of these. And one fate, fate off the remainder. Yes, indeed. Then add fate to unclaimed rings. Only two at this time. Mm -hmm. Rings can be returned. Yeah, let's get those rings then back in that pool. regroup. So cheeky ready up. And uh, pass the first player token. So you were first player there, is that correct? That's you now. And then on to me. So let's flip, flip, flip Adelphia. Oh, so I've got my champion now. Um, during, and then I've got this academy. During the conflict phase, real top card, conflict deck. I can play it as if it was in my hand. One, two. So I had that. One, two, three. One, two, three. Now we have. Uh, yeah. Oh, we've got a lot of shenanigans. Not really. Choose up to two face down cards and flip this turn choosing cards face up. Have you played them? Uh, oh yeah. <laughs> um, well, you can use those actions during... The dynasty phase? Yeah, so you can like pop that. I'll give you a face down card for him later. Play that, give you a face down card, then you can flip them up and you can get going. This seems like a reasonable board to me. Yeah, it looks good actually. Depending on how I feel about uh, holds. Okay. Right, me to play first. Indeed it is. Uh, I see that you've got your champion there. I do, and it's, it's quite tempting. I shall be I need to get honest. some money. No, no, no. <laughs> Four, um, yeah, I see. So it's... I should have nine. Four, five, six, seven, eight. Let's just have a little look. Let's plan ahead, shall we? No, Barry, it's overrated. <laughs> it is a little overrated, I'll give you that. Don't expend your brain energy on this nonsense. Save it for later. P.S. I hate this shameful display. Shall I? Should I? One, two, four, five. Oof. One, two, three. Boom. Well, Let's seems... take a hit for a turn. Yeah, seems legit. And then I replace the card. All right, so I'll probably do exactly as you said. I'm going to take an action to discard this. Yep, let's you draw a card. Indeed. Immediately replaced. This is immediately replaced. Interesting. Uh, I'm going to pass. Yep, that seems legit. And so I'm going to spend one of my like many fates here to bring out my surpassed samurai, uh -huh. who's immediately replaced. Uh, well, I'll pass, so it's just you. Go nuts. Yep. You've got a. Refreshing so, lemonade. <laughs> I get rid of this uh, stand ground uh, card to flip these two face up. Uh, does, do you have to discard it? Uh, no. Nope. No, I don't. It's just an action. Yep. All right, very well. So he's been replaced by the owner general and my champion. Well, that seems like a pretty good flip. Yes, indeed. Um, I'd love to bring them both out. I can't afford it. I think probably... Get one. <laughs> yeah, I can get one. I think it's probably going to be my champ. Because well, he's going to go. The problem is this is Correct, uh, yep. broken. 
Problem is, if you break that, the, I lose the general, so that sucks. So maybe let's not let you do that somehow. <laughs> I'll have to be clever. Good advice. Um, well, the honor general's very good, though. Oh, but the champion's my champion, man. Okay, Akoto Totori. This is it. We've both got our champions in play. Um, yep. That's super spicy. Yes, indeed. Very well. I pass now. Are you ready for some... Um, I just need to read what this does. <laughs> nah, forget about it. Just don't use it. Okay, that's spicy. Cool beans. Yeah? Yeah, let's do it. Four. Two. I have an interesting plan here. You got some more shenanigans before? Are you reducing the dial by one? No, I'm going to use the contingency plan to go up by one, actually. Not bad. I'll give you one. Draw cards. Yeah. <clears throat> Boom. Nice. Very well. All right, Barry, this is it. Jewel of the Fates. Well, you could win the game this round. Call, uh, I could, yes. I'm unlikely to. But <laughs> uh, so, action. You can trigger this during the conflict phase. Reveal the top card of your conflict deck. Until the end of the phase, you may play the card as if it was in your hand. Admit defeat. Choose a character that is defending alone. Bow that character. Right. I hate it. <laughs> Interesting. No? Also, not great to have revealed to me. No, no, it's but... fine. Don't whine about it. Um... Oh, that was stupid. What was stupid? Doing that. Right. What does air do? Steal your honor. What does water do? Ready characters. No, I really wanted to say flows. <laughs> <laughs> um, cool beans. Uh, let's take void. Void gets rid of fate. Correct. Ugh. Politicking. Ugh. In the manicured garden. Yep. With your champion. And your wandering Ronin. Hi. Intriguing. And that lets you remove a fate for one fate from one character, right? Well, I'm gonna take two, because after you claim a ring during a political conflict in which this character is participating, resolve that ring's effect. So effectively get it twice. That sucks. That sucks indeed. But your current standing is uh, eight, right? Six, seven, eight. I don't think I can win that, even if I committed everybody to it. <laughs> that was the... Out of three, nope. four, five, six. No, that's nope. nothing. She's zero. Yep. Three, four, five. I'd have eight. Eight's the best I can do if I commit everybody. Yep. Interesting. Well, I feel like this might be a lost cause, Barry. But what if I won it? But what if you won it? <laughs> Would that be of any use to me? Unknown. If I won it, I feel as though it would just not be worth it. Especially not with your honored khaki. I mean, I just, everybody would be bowed. I would have nothing left. To do anything with. Oh, what a shame. Yeah. Pro tip. Not a shame. <laughs> Pro tip. <laughs> I'm not sad about that. Oh, my poor champion. He's basically just going to go in around. Everything is military. <laughs> That's your jam. Politics is me. Military is you. Yeah, I need more military stuff going on. Now, I'm going to go out on a limb here and assume you're not taking the fate off of Matsu. <laughs> you never know. Yeah, I don't know. You never know. So. So, what tricks have you got in your hand, Barry? Don't worry about it. I am worried about it. I don't have enough tricks to win this one, I don't think. I'm not worried about it. <laughs> Can't defend alone. Yeah. <laughs> Go to sleep. 
Hay que chuparlo bien. And don't forget your uh, plus one. Oh shit, yeah, thanks Barry. I did forget. Yeah, I can tell. <laughs> The fact it was way over there where you've not looked in the last 10 minutes. That's it, Barry. I'm committing everyone. Except for uh, Matsu. What? He's useless. No, why? Um, it's a, this is this is the deciding conflict. I've decided this is the battleground. This is the battleground. It's politics. Okay, well, that's, uh, that's spicier than I anticipated. So you get first uh, action. I'm going to take a fate. That's unreasonable to me. Um... Sure, well, let's make you go to sleep. All right, shit. So I lose three, right? Uh, what are you on? Oh, sorry, you were on one, two, three. I can't make you go to sleep, it's two. Um, so let's just make you go to sleep. Oh, yeah, on the same. Yeah, sorry, I thought you were just on two because I was looking at that when you. Okay, so now we're drawn. Um, yep, but I do win ties. That's true indeed. Let's uh, let's put this ornate fan on my champion. Oh, that is nice. Bumps him up by two. Be a shame if anybody had a dodgy photocopied one. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Again, so missing a card. I've, having changed my uh, strongholds, so I don't have dodgy cards in it. I then find. I was just really hoping you wouldn't draw it for multiple reasons. Yeah. <laughs> One of which is that it's a dodgy photocopy. So, by the way, if anyone doesn't know, the ornate fan is, of course, the classic weapon of the cunning politician. Plus two political strength for fanning. All right. Let's see. Oh, Barry, you're making me sweat. You're making me sweat. So we're, we're, we're evens. Is this where we're at? Yeah, we're evens. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten to my ten. So I need to get over that so i'm going to go ahead and uh, i'm going to pay my fate here that i just grabbed oh. what is this here i don't know why i've got money on my stack there um and i'm going to bring the uh ancestral blade into play here what does that do plus one plus one. Oh, that is spicy now do i put it on this person though yeah that doesn't make sense to put on anyone else uh-huh one way or the other. Plus one, plus one. Very well. I shall. Perfect gift, which is why it was silly to do this one now. Reveal the top four cards of each player's conflict deck. Add one to its owner's hand. Do you choose? I do. I think I might want to start by having a look at your cards. <laughs> now, the question is, what happens to my remaining cards? They get shuffled back in. They get shuffled back in. Yeah. So, Master of the Spears for three. I feel like I could give you that because you can't do anything with it. Uh, you're no good. Yes. Enjoy. One mass of the spear. These get shuffled uh, back in. Then for myself. <laughs> uh oh. That is yeah. exactly what you're looking for, yeah. <laughs> That'll do. Uh, you go away and then shuffle. Your action. So I've chosen court games. During a political conflict, select one. Choose another participating character you control, or your opponent chooses and dishonors a participating character. She can, he or she can go to sleep. So I must dishonor one. No, 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 no. So I uh, I choose whether I honor or you choose to dishonor. So yeah. I'm going to choose to honor because I get plus three. Yeah, that makes sense. Or am I? <laughs> uh, I think you should honor the Wandering Ronin. Yeah, I know. It doesn't seem uh, worth it. Yeah, sure. Uh, but it's now your action. So I've just seen you pick up that card. Mm -hmm. And I'm thinking... So now I'm thinking, I'm thinking, it's my action, right? It is your action. I'm one ahead. You are currently one ahead. Is that right? Uh, six. Yep. Seven. Ten. Eleven. Six, seven, eight, nine. Yep. yep. Okay, well, uh, I pass this action. All right, I'm going to court games during mm -hmm. a political challenge. I'm now on 13. 13. Okay. Still not enough to break it, but that's okay. Interesting. I would like to prevent you from breaking it. Well, I'm not at the moment. Yeah, that's true. So you're on uh, 13? I am on 13. Which means I can't go below 9 if I want to prevent you from breaking it. Dun dun dun. <laughs> dun dun. 
Bum, oh, bum, it's bum, a strategic bum. back and forth. What happened to your face-up cards? Uh, which face? I uh, went away because uh, I used the action before uh, looking at the top four, and then they got shuffled back in. Okay, so that's it got shuffled saying, back that's in. That's what I said. I should have done it after, um, right. after this. That's why you right. said that. Your All right, let's... Uh, mm. I'm going to sacrifice my uh, favorable ground yep. to take my steadfast samurai out of the fight. Uh, okay. Get card back. So 13 to your... 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Um, yeah, let's, let's go in the last rank. You might want to read that one. Holy cow. But I'll explain it to you. Effectively, I'm going to give myself the duel ability, mm -hmm. which is going to let me initiate a duel with one of your characters on my turn. You can uh, you can then use cards instead of your dial, should you so wish. Um, what? Yeah, Attach so character works, gains <laughs> action. While this... <laughs> That's the one I kind of showed. While this character... Yeah, I saw it um, a little <laughs> bit, but I didn't for the life of me mm. get anything from it. Um... While this character is participating in a conflict, choose a participating character controlled by your opponent, challenging that character to a military duel. Instead of giving honor for this duel's bid, a player may choose and discard the required number of cards from their hand. Bow the loser of the duel. Holy shit. So what's going to happen now? <laughs> well, your action. Nothing. Yeah, I mean... I'm okay, I'm going to uh, activate the duel to duel this guy. So it's... Uh, so it's credits. currently six to... Uh, that's 66 in that case, isn't it? Yeah, it is. I mean, I might as well fight him. He's 7, though. Oh, no, definitely fight this one, then. <laughs> uh, 6 to 6. Well, what happens in a tie in that case? Uh, we're going to have to refer to the rule book, I think. Now, uh, this is the first time a duel's come up. Um, I'm sure I mentioned it in the explanation yeah. of the I'm game hoping. last night. But, uh... Bear with me here. It's in the advanced rules section. At the back. Advanced concepts. If they are the same, neither player wins nor loses. Ah, well, that might be a waste of time in that case. I suppose that depends on whether you have any shenanigans for increasing. Yeah, it's a bit tough to do. Well, okay, I'm not going to trigger that because all that will happen is both bid five, and then in the end. Well, wait um, a minute, Barry. I don't have. Oh, I don't oh but you can, you, you can still use this. Oh, you can still use yeah, that. Yeah. So, uh, it's. Instead of giving honor for the duel, a player may choose and discard, uh, but you can also... Right, so you, you discard cards to. instead of giving up honor. Yeah. I don't think you can swap between the two. Yeah, but Barry, that's the that's the beauty of the game. I might not bid five. I might be like, oh, no, you, I you, need my cards. You would bid five. I might not. You don't know what I would do. Mm. Well, I'm still currently winning. Um, but by three, Barry. Oh, that was a waste of time, wasn't it? Can't do any shenanigans, so I too will pass. No point doing a duel. I'd be like, I thought you were on like less, and I could just guarantee and push it through, but you are not. I am not. Uh, so I have a cheeky win. Indeed, you do. I'll remove one from there, triggering her reaction, and then I'll remove one from there for claiming the ring. Ooh. And um, but I only win by three, so I don't break it. So everybody's... Oh, uh, sorry, I've got another reaction to winning. After you win a political conflict, dishonour a friendly participating character. Uh, discard two cards at random from your opponent's hand. Do -do -do. One, two. Okay. Damn it. Spicy. There's my vengeful oath keep both my characters. Yep. So I'm going to come back, go to sleep. Yeah, go to sleep, you. You will do likewise. Yeah, all my people. And then it's your challenge. Well, that was only the first challenge. So. Yeah. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> this game takes forever. This is like Game of Thrones over here. Da, da. Well, back and forth. But yeah, I could, couldn't pull out the bag, unfortunately, in the end there. But I do still have that ability. Mm -hmm. All right. Let's go. Who have you got going on there? What's that? So that she's man? Kind of, uh, this man is nothing. I can't bring him. Well, if I bring him out, each uh, he's got sincerity, so when he goes away, I draw a card. And each honoured character also gains sincerity. Huh. Until he goes away. Until he goes away. He's quite powerful. Um, no, I think that stays. I think I just... I don't know. I'd say it's only when he's out. Mm. It would make more sense that way. Well, you'd forget about him otherwise. Yeah. 
So you've still got both your challenges available to you. Mm -hmm. Well, it seems silly to do a political challenge on account of the fact that, um, you know, I have uh, no not a lot, polit not not a lot of politicking <laughs> going on, yeah. Well, this foreign military, I'm two, three, four, five at the moment. Yeah, indeed you are. So what have I got available to me here? There's water and air with nice monies on them. Ooh, nice monies, nice monies. I like the monies. Everybody likes monies. All right, here we go. We're going military water against the shameful display. That's air. That's air. They're fucking, they all look the same, man. <laughs> wow. Can't say that about people. <laughs> I'm saying that about rings, bro. <laughs> These uh, legendary five rings. We're putting committing both of these people. Therefore, I have a military power of two. Um, very well. You're coming in for two. Yes. Two military. If you win that, you can make me go to sleep. I could make you go to sleep. That's true. Yeah. If that's what I wanted to do. I could also ready someone. Also true. Um, I might as well defend. So it's two on five. Yep. Okay. I'm going to uh, activate my uh, castle to go up to four. Okay. Now it's four on five. Yeah. Agreed. <laughs> Your action. Pass. Are you sure? Uh huh. Okay, I'm going to use Banzai. Okay. Um, I'm going to choose a participating character in the conflict to give plus two. Uh, this one. And yep. I'm going to give up an honor to use it again. Yep. That one. Plus two to each. Mm, yeah, okay. I'm not sure if you can split out this thing. Uh, it says you can lose one honor to resolve this ability twice. Yeah. yeah, yeah. You're but thinking I might not be able to use it. Yeah, no, I don't know if you can split out. Let's go with yeah. I can, yeah, you get the action twice. Okay, so you're on eight to my five. Is that how things are going down at the moment? Um, three, four here. Yeah. And uh, one, two, three, four here. Yeah, yeah. so correct. eight to my five. That is correct. Uh, action, honor, dishonor. You're dishonoring my steadfast samurai. Yeah. Sad times. I'm assuming that's fine. Um, I believe you can at least choose a character to be honoured, even though they can't go another level up. So that's seven to five. Your action. I did want to break this province barrier. I assumed so. It makes me sad. Trying my darkness to prevent you from doing so. Well, seeing as I tried incredibly hard to prevent you from <laughs> breaking the manicured garden, it's only fair. Um, Um, yep, yeah, I, I have no action at this time. All right, me neither. So, any reaction to winning? Um, well, no, not from uh, cards or anything. All right, so one ring for you. Suddenly standing back up. Indeed, it's my champion. Yeah, seems reasonable to me. Uh, everybody goes home, sleepy sleeps. Knelt. All right, so then it's you for military. Uh, yeah, but I've got nothing going on, so that's fine. Uh, end of the... No, I've got another challenge. Oh, yeah. I can politic, yeah. Oh, so you do, of course. Yeah, yeah, yeah. that's right. So, uh, I'm going to go uh, politics, yep. fire, in on the shameful display. Yep, that is true. I forgot you had a second thing. It's because we spent hours yeah, on your uh, one! <laughs> whose fault is that? <laughs> um, <laughs> fine, uh, undefended. Mm-hmm. Any other shenanigans? Um, nope, no, I don't think so. Um, sadly, nothing further to add to that. So I lose an honor for it being undefended. You break that. It goes away. Uh, do you want that to go away? Get rid of it. And a savvy politician. Well, I don't like them, so that uh, works. Hey, guess Just what? Go. I'm gonna normalize my Matsu Biona. He... Oh yeah, good for choice. winning a fire challenge. Good choice. With all that fate, I decided I want to do something useful. Yeah, mm -hmm. he's asleep. Um, done. End of the round. You keep this. Do you want yeah. to flip it? I keep the imperial favor. Um, 
Nope, I think I'm going to stick with my politicking bonus. Alright, alright. So, discarding characters, they mm -hmm. cancel out. I'm going to lose a fate here. Boop. You lose a fate. Let's come back up. Uh, then, add fate to unclaimed rounds. Those ones go back. Then... Ready cards, the scars from provinces, that's broken. So Game is over because this guy's going away as well, isn't he? Oh no. Uh, sorry, that should have been replaced. It makes no odds. Um, that has to go. Yep. That has no, because it's face down. Oh, yeah, of course. Yeah. Okay. Face down. Totally face up. Yep. Uh, first player token. Was that first there? Yeah, it was. Yeah. We know. And then, and then. That's it. Done. You in? What? Yeah, man. Let's see what happens. What's going on? Spicy. Cool beans. Uh, get some money. Damn it. <laughs> I got all my uh, good characters on the table here. It makes me sad. I really wanted to bring the Honor General in, but I feel like Ikoma Aiji is probably a more prudent choice at this point. What does he do after you lose a political conflict? That could happen. Uh, uh, put a Bushi character yeah. printed cost three or lower into play from your dynasty discard pile or province. Um, which is quite plausibly, quite likely to happen. All right, so let's pay four to bring him out. We'll stick a two, two characters. Spicy. Okay. Um, all right, I think all right. I should have been the stabling ground. Staging ground. Staging ground. Yeah, I should have got rid of him because I can't attack you. And I knew that wouldn't be able to attack you. But he is a defender of the realm. He's a guardsman, not an assaultsman. Mm -hmm. All very true. Um... To be honest, I'm still exhausted from my last political fight. Yeah, so one, <laughs> uh, he's fine as is. Get a replacement. You. Um... I'll drop two to bring in my uh, my uh, mystic. Mm -hmm. I have this problem where um, oh, what's that? Cautious uh, scout. Well, he's attacking alone. Uh, province boxes are blank. Ooh, while he's attacking alone, yes. province boxes are blank. Interesting. Yeah. Hmm. Okay, me indeed. Right. Um, well, we're still in the uh, dynasty phase. Yeah. One, one presumes you're passing, but uh, yes, I will pass because yep. I have no money. That's fine. Put shenanigans. My favorite kind of nanigans. Um, but no, I'm I'm concerned by the lack of cards here and the lack of cards here, and I feel yeah. like I can't really resolve both. <laughs> effectively. Uh, I'm passing there. All of this, there is a very distinct lack of cards. Yeah. Well, you lose, remember, if you lose, uh, just get shuffled back in. Yeah, but you lose, lose five, five yeah, which is problematic. Because um, I think we've, have we both got eight? No, you've got I've nine. I've got nine, crushing it. Crushing. Officially <laughs> crushing it. I have chosen. Me too. Okay. I've got great. an action. Reduce my dial to zero. Okay, great. Take two of these. Interesting, interesting, interesting. Okay, so uh, me, right, first? Yep. Show me what you got. Gets tricky in this last. Don't know what's going on. So I think I take water. It's still air, but carry on. Right, air, <laughs> air also good. Air good. Air comes with honor. Honor yep. good. Um
Where would you like to attack? I've got an unknown one. Military here on the one I know. Uh huh. With. What's her action there? Uh, she well, she just gives somebody else plus three politics. Okay, well, that's not very useful for you oh, right now, is it? Nah, not unless you're coming in for politics. Uh, nope, I've already declared military. Yep. <laughs> because <laughs> that's my jam, man. Uh, all right, with this in mind, let's go in with these two. Boom, shaka, waka. Matsu, Bayona, and Akoto, Turi. Uh, very well. Question. Yeah. If I want to put another attachment on him... It's fine, unless they're restricted. Oh, it's only restricted. You can only have two restricted cards. Right, that's right. Which attachment can you use? Discard pile. Yeah, that's fine. Okay. Uh, I shall... I mean, it, it may or may not come up. We don't know. Yeah, I shall defend. With her? Uh-huh. Ooh, military power of... Uh, six. Six. Ooh, okay. To my ten. Yeah. Uh, first action for me? Yep. I'm going to duel this guy. I mean, that makes perfect sense. Why wouldn't you? Yep. Fine. Yeah, you win. I go home. What I should have done was bid nothing. That's what I should have done. Uh, so that's it. Bow oh, I'm still in the conflict, so, but I'm sleeping. Uh, so do I give you, or is it the difference? <clears throat> oh, hold on. That's a great question. Uh, the player with a higher bid must give the difference. If the bids are tied, no honour changes hands. Oh, interesting. Uh, I did not know that. I was just prepared to go down to one honour. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, I should have, uh, yeah, actually, I should have done nothing. And just taken me, mm -hmm. taken me for uh, a thing. So, um, my action then. Yep. Interesting. I'm going to pay two to put down my uh, Sashimono banner on him. Uh, attach the bushy cat in control, attach the not bow. Yep. As a result of a military conflict. Yeah, yeah. Stay standing. Oh, what a moron. This is a military challenge, isn't it? Never mind. Do you have military shenanigans? No, uh, just like he can't attack. He should have been the defender as well. Oh, yes, yes. I was surprised about that. Yeah, yeah I, I forgot. You can put him in if you want. Um, well, it doesn't really make that much odds, does it? No, I don't um, think so. Not after the duel. <clears throat> I'm in fact on 10. Man, I'm in trouble again. This thing is a pain in the ass. Well, you took away all of his life, but he's going to hang in there. He's going to yeah, make the most of it while he's still here. Ah, uh, it's annoying. Um, this is my honorable rising sun banner that stops me from battling. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I concede. Concede this uh, challenge? No, concede the game. Are you sure? Yes, because you'll... Politics here. Can't do anything about it. And I can't stop you from breaking it with five. With five politics? Yep. Because the most I can get is three. Uh, you swing in with him and him. Potentially him. Nothing. Right, and that's your entrenched and position. And nothing I can do about it. GG. But I had the good omen. I was going to get a fate back to Yeah. <laughs> well, you still can. You still can. But that is it. That is game. Um, that swung wildly. Yeah. You Yeah, like that was the same thing you beat me with last time. Him not going to sleep is so a massive pain in the ass. Because um, I don't have anybody. I don't have the guy that does things. He was the bottom card last time we played as well. Oh my god, yeah. This, so this is Barry's <laughs> duelist. He's well cool. Yeah. Um, he duels people as well. I like. I really like the duel mechanic. I'm glad that it came up. Yes, even though it was a weird one. Even though yeah, it was a yeah. weird duelist training, Pretty yeah. Pretty cool. Also, on your uh, your champion, who's a bit more of a politician, perhaps, than a uh, military type. Yeah, but you can duel during politics. Uh, but it's a military duel. Yeah, the duel... The, the, so the duel is actually created by an, a, a sort of a, a thing called a challenge. It'll say it allows you to challenge someone to a duel. And the challenge will have a type military or poli political. And that'll be based on... Um, that'll be based on the card rather than yeah. what it's attached to. Um, Typically. And actually, none of my cards would have helped me out much there for uh, military. I had... Um, 
I could have sent him home, but that wouldn't have helped. He still would have broken the uh, hmm. the thingy. I could have got and plus one from my. If, uh, if I was if I was able to get rid of you. Could you have done that? Well, if I won the duel, if you were sleeping. Right, yes, yeah. Yeah. Um, well, I was like, yeah, look, I'm just going to, I was like, I'm going to go down to one fate. Maybe yeah. I can get two <laughs> back from this water uh, thing. Yeah. It might not make any difference. And that was that. The end. GG. So, that's how the game plays. Mm -hmm. um, I had, like, no cards left in either deck. Well, I, was I had two there. Yeah. Not much more here. Oh, no, wait, I had three here, didn't I? Yeah, I think we had the same number of dynasty cards, which makes sense. Uh, what left? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because yeah. nobody, I think we only shuffled away a couple. By yeah, choice. I didn't, everything was sort of playing. Ugh. Now sorting them back out, everything goes back into three decks, which is yeah, that's a thing. So one, two, three, four, five, and my. So my uh, missing province there was meditations of the Tao. During a conflict at this province, choose an attacking character. Remove one fate from that character. This is also Spicy. one that you missed, I think, in our other games. What by not going to? Yeah, by yeah. this is the, the this one has remained hidden in all of our <laughs> our games. So it's a secret. It's, it's, it's the secret's out. Oh no, you've got all the information. I also had entrenched position. No, I didn't. Yeah, for politics. Lands. Yeah, yours. Yours yeah. the other way. So that's kind of the other way. Yeah. Because you're a military one. Makes sense for me to have that. that. But that you just had so many attachments on that fella at that point. Um, yeah, well, he's got an ancestral sword, a banner, and a fan, which in Japan is like an arsenal. Yes. <laughs> or in uh, Rakugan, sorry. Because that's not restricted. Yeah, so it's only one restricted, so you've got mm -hmm. a number of... Um, it's only restricted items that are... I could also have played, actually, one more item from my great... No, that's the item I can that's, play. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was I had it. Way. I had it. You would have been able to bring it back. Uh, later. Yeah. But actually, again, that was what kind of... Uh, I was kicking myself there actually for not using the Maya Mystic to remove your oh, jewel wait. before you I got... get one. Because you won the jewel by then. It wasn't the time. You were on seven plus yeah, one. Yeah, but I think four. it's just the bids, isn't it? Uh, is it if the bids are No, it's a, it's a difference, right? I don't know. Great question. I thought it was the difference in the jewel settings. Go to the higher bid, must be a Yeah, okay. Yep. I need my so six most, honor. The most I could have had off you was four. Right, yeah, because the difference would have... Because you, you can't set zero, yeah. yeah. Which would have left me with two. But uh, unbeknownst to me, actually, you'd seen ahead that I could break your stronghold. But that's because I didn't know what you had under it. Yeah, yeah, of course. But I um, definitely would have swung the political at it. Yeah, because yeah. even if you lost, you had that other guy to bring a character in. Um, yeah. So you, you would have probably just gone for it. certainly gone for it. And you would have seen that only had three and without any further tricks. Yeah, you're, uh, the characters left on the table for you were slightly uh, underwhelming, I think. They were a little underpowered. I could have brought out uh, that guy that was for politics, though. Oh, wait, he's not a green guy. He's a white card, dynasty card. But you could still have... had one I more. could have brought out him. Yeah. Um, although I don't think I had enough money for him in the end. Uh... Yeah. yeah just a... He looks very cheerful. I like him. But I, I don't know. Um, I think Crane's fine. Needs... But needs a slightly more consistent deck as to what characters you're going to see. Mm -hmm. I think the same can be said for, for all the Well, I think the thing about that deck as well is those Wandering Ronin are super strong. And yeah. if I, like, I knew that now going into this <laughs> yeah. game, I was like, get rid of those. <laughs> Whereas, um, you know, if you can sort of get those on the board with like four fate on them or whatever, they're, they're horrifying. Once again, I also have one of them in my deck and it didn't come up. Again, that, that's really for you need consistency. So there's only 24 cards. In the dynasty deck and 22 cards maybe in the conflict deck. We should have 30 of each. Uh, no, not even close. Um, and in a tournament deck, you've got 40 to 45 in each. But you can have up to three, so yeah. you get the consistency. It's like 22 in here. Yeah, you've got like 22, 23. So um, that's what you get for one core set. Core set, literally just the core basics. <laughs> but you do get another six clans worth of cards. That's true. But not enough to make a tournament deck, really. Um... But if you are going to be a tournament player, you're probably going to want to buy three anyway uh, to give you the best deck building options. Yeah, well, I agree. Like uh, that's well, that and that's the thing. Like, um, and if you look at uh, any of our local game stores, they sell the core set or they sell three core sets at a um, you know, at a sort of a slightly reduced price. You know, yeah, like get everybody to buy in. Yeah, are you going to buy in, Barry? Yeah, I've already uh, already making plans for the launch events and uh, get into that. See how it goes. 
I think I might wait a bit because I bought into Lord of the uh, Game of Thrones and I bought into Game of Thrones in a big way, and I never had time to play it. Um, unfortunately, I just couldn't keep up with the meta, you... and uh, the game was when I played it very confusing. Well, the good thing about this is it's sort of got a built-in reset. So resets are mm-hmm. a big thing in Thrones, but the built-in resets here you you tick down timer for fate, and it's impossible yes. to have a truly massive board, or maybe not impossible, but very this hard to have a truly. Seems massive board. a lot quicker than Thrones. Plus, also, I feel like uh, that massive political challenge we had. Yeah. That was felt huge for Legend of the Five Rings, yeah. but that almost feels like every challenge in Thrones feels like that. Least, especially, yeah, five especially, yeah, yeah. especially towards the second half of the games. And then you've got three well, of those, no, potentially yeah, no six, six per phase. Whereas in this, there's only ever going to be four or less. Yes. So it, it feels sort of quicker and dirtier, which I like. Can be. And we did have a good sort of back and forth with playing your conflict cards. So, okay, I'm ahead, you're ahead, yeah. I'm ahead, you're ahead. We had some really good uh, back and forths, especially at the uh, the start when I was sure that I was going to get you and then you just <laughs> trumped everything. I was like, no, I've lost this and played all my good cards. Yeah. I really need to win last turn. If I'd won on your... If you let me break that province with the political challenge, mm-hmm. and then I could have probably got in for... Because I, I already knew what your stronghold was. Yeah. The plus five military. And so I'd already gone in for military... And I knew that I could bust that with nine defense or whatever I had, or five to work politics. And you wouldn't have had enough to defend. Because I could have sent one person home and have another card to send a person home. Yeah. So yeah, if you if I'd broken that province, you would have lost. But you broke my provinces and then I couldn't defend. So I had that's to, the game. <laughs> I have to defend those provinces, man. Like yeah, yeah. it's it's I think there is a really sort of tac- interesting tactical co- tactical consideration to uh when do you sort of let a province fall and when do you sort of commit to defending yeah. it like that's a key a key decision you've got to make good up, up to four times <laughs> <laughs> well up to three yeah. times always defend the fourth one yeah always defend <laughs> the fourth time always go all in on that one right and uh, it'll be interesting to see how as the dynasty packs come out and the decks develop uh, the honor mechanic and the winning with 25 you need 25 honor to win yeah which uh, is quite hard out of the core set I think it's. I think it's. Uh, I don't think it's impossible out of three core sets. With three core sets, yeah, yeah. yeah. So the other factions actually deal a lot more with honor. Crab, uh, sorry, not crab. Scorpion will try and dishonor you, and I think uh, some of the other ones are, are heavier on the the honor. Uh, I feel like if I was going to play this game, I'd have to play a faction that got lots of either got loads and loads of mooks or got lots of honor, like honored soldiers. Because uh, I hate being dishonored in this game. <laughs> like I hate it when it's like I, I like you see that big powerful character you just put all your fate on dishonored, they suck now. Yeah. Well done. Or I'll just play a faction with no honor at all. Like sorry, no glory, no glory mm. at all. So when I'm dishonored, I'm like, who cares, yeah, man? <laughs> but you still lose your honor, of course, when you die. But yeah, that's playing. true. Yeah, yeah. But uh, GG. WB. Well, thank you for coming back and playing, Bear. Never coming really... back again. <laughs> that's it. That was the last time. <laughs> So, uh, FFG, if you want more videos like this, high quality videos, release more LCGs so Barry will come yeah. and play with me here <laughs> on Cult time. of the New. <laughs> and uh, thanks to everybody who's watched the video. I hope that you've enjoyed our game and uh, watching us play. I hope you're excited for uh, Legend of the Five Rings. And uh, we'll see you all tomorrow with something brand new. Bye. <laughs> the end.